Shalom. This is Brother Montezal from the Indiana camp. Uh, I'm getting a quick lesson on uh, going out on the highways and the byways. Uh, but before I go into it real quick, uh, I want to give all praises and glory to Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. Double honors to all the uh, apostles and elders of uh, Great Millstone and peace and salutation to all you Akim out there pushing this truth and truth and sincerity and charity. Shalom. Um, We're going to go right into it. This is a uh, this is going into uh, um, why it's important that we go out in the highways and the byways. Um, it's important because, you know, uh, it wouldn't make sense. You know, the Most High, He's a power of order. Uh, he's not a power of, uh, of, of conf He's not the, the author of confusion. So the Lord does everything in the order. Uh, this is uh, Romans uh, 12 and 1. He said, I beseech you, therefore, brethren, by the mercies of the power that ye present your bodies a living sacrifice holy acceptable and to the power which is your reasonable service so you're supposed to present yourself as a uh, living sacrifice you know that's the same thing the lord did you know he presented himself as a living sacrifice he actually laid down his own life you know gave his own life up you know that we uh that that so that we can have salvation, man. You know, we we are in debt to Yahweh Hashem Yahushua, man. We we in debt to Him, so we got to go out there in the highways, man, and byways to make ourselves a living sacrifice for Yahweh Hashem Yahushua, man. If we don't make ourselves a living sacrifice, you know, what's the what's the point, man? What's the, what's the point of being uh, part of the call, man? You know, if you if you part of the call and you just sitting there and you and you got a, a willing able body you know you're supposed to go out there in the highways and the byways man and make yourself a living sacrifice man either you're gonna go out there you get with a camp or you're gonna go out there on your own man you know you're supposed to be making yourself a a, a, a reasonable uh making yourself a, a a living sacrifice which is a reasonable service man very reasonable man the lord you know he did it you know, we 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 supposed to follow and do everything Yahweh Shah did, man. Everything, we even to the point when we willing to die, man, and lay down our own lives, man. You know, even for the law, we we lay down our lives too for the sheep, man. You know, because that's what our job is to do. Our job is to do what? Go out in the highways and the byways and preach the gospel, man. Preach the gospel to wake up the elect, and we might end up losing our life. You know, and doing so, that's what we're doing every week. Week in, week out, we risking our lives, man. Out in the highways and the byways to wake up the elect, man. To push the gospel, man. And we got to be willing to lay our, our lives down too, man. You got to be willing to lay down your life for this truth, man. If you ain't willing to lay down your life for the truth, man. Man, this may not be for you, man. Maybe you should go to church on Sunday. Maybe you should go ahead and you support Chops. Go back to the barbershop, get you a lining, you know, go back in the world, get you some shrimp, man. Start wasting your own time, you know. This is not for this is not for the weakling, man. This is for the strong, man. Those who in the spirit, those who are strong through the spirit of Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh, shot. But yeah, that's why it's important, man, you know, because we, we doing this for the elect, to wake up the elect, man, so that the Lord can come back, man. To stop wasting time, man. Get out there in the highways and the byways and make yourself a reasonable service, man. And with that, I want to give all praises and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai. I want to say peace and uh, uh, double honors to the apostles and, uh, and elders of Great Millstone and um, uh, Shalom to all you Akim out there pushing this truth and truth and sincerity.